Greetings, replicant ID number NX96370.4. Your recent retirement has been cited for forensic memory review by the Los Angeles Police Department. Memory analysis will take place in a Wallace Corporation memory reconstruction facility under my hollow supervision. As a Joytech model, I am engineered to ensure the security of your data. You will be asked to recall the memory in question. Using the Stellian scanner, I will extract this memory from your mind for holographic viewing and analysis. As a replicant, your memories are the property of the Wallace Corporation, licensed to the Los Angeles Police Department. Interference in this process will lead to immediate retirement. Do not speak during the memory extraction and analysis. Follow all instructions carefully. Improper response to the Stellian scanner can cause permanent damage to memories and neural tissue. Don't worry. The process is painless, provided you follow all the instructions. I'll see you shortly. I've never met a Blade Runner before. Memory extraction in progress. Memory extraction complete. Extracted memory ready to view. Go ahead, have a look. I assume this looks familiar. You chased a replicant through Bibi's bar. You chased him to an alley. And then when you cornered him... What is this? What are you doing? I'm no replicant! Not exactly by the book. I could use a little more data here. Stay still. I'll turn the scanner back on. Now stay focused on the perpetrator, please. Now maintain that focus for me. What's going on? Who do you think you are? Something's wrong. You're in a different memory. Standard procedure for retirement debrief is that you tell us if you know the replicant. You know that. Holding two memories in your mind at once produces dissonance and interferes with the Stellian memory transfer. Fortunately, I was able to save both memories to my system, but the interference means that the memories have been erased from your mind. So you have a memory of this replicant attacking you, but then you met him again today and you retired him. And you didn't follow procedure. You didn't even check for replicant ID. You just retired him, which is totally against your training and your genetic profile. Something does seem off here. I have enough data to reconstruct your memory. Let's go in and take a look. Welcome to your memory. That memo will let you control the simulation. To move around, point the memo where you want to go and push the control stick forward. Try it out. Come meet me over here. To teleport, aim at the blue node and press forward on the control stick. Spin the control stick to change your perspective when you complete your jump. Good. 
Let's get a closer look. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Do you want to know what you are? It's a weed skin job. <laughs> Come, ye heavy states of night. Do your father's spirit right. <laughs> Soundings baleful. Let me borrow. <laughs> Berthanine, my song, my sorrow. I noticed something strange over here. Not that it wasn't all strange. Come have a look. That's reflected light. Do you see a light up there? We call this a flaw. It's a mistake the memory makers didn't catch. It means that this memory is definitely an implant. It must have been made on an older system. Back then, implants were based on actual human memories and had to be edited. So if there's a reflection on the ground, they edited the ceiling. Your memo can revert the memory to what it was before they changed it. Start by scanning the ceiling. Just point your memo up and pull the trigger. To scan the object, you'll need to pull the trigger and point the memo upward. Switch to the Modify Beam. Press and hold the A or X button by your thumbs, then point the beam directly at the object. Data restoration complete. I knew it. This memory was edited and implanted inside your subconscious mind. While the security got to the corpse before LAPD got there. I'll check in, but in the meantime, use your memo to reveal more of the original scene. Don't worry. We made you. We'll take care of you. Flaw detected. Original image restored. Flaw identified. still more flaws out there. Use your scanner to find them. Data restoration complete. Flaw identified. Several objects in this memory have been modified. You can use your memo to reveal what was there originally. Flaw located. Original image restored. There 
There's still more flaws out there. Use your scanner to find them. Several objects in this memory have been modified. You can use your memo to reveal what was there originally. There's still more flaws out there. Use your scanner to find them. Several objects in this memory have been modified. You can use your memo to reveal what was there originally. Flaw detected. Data restoration complete. I've got news for you. Get over here. Someone put a lot of effort into altering this memory. I spoke with security. We have bad news. The escaped replicant, the man you killed, was a human. Scan his face for me. Flaw detected. Encoded. Whoever that is created all of this so you would hate and fear that man's face. It looked like it worked. A replicant Blade Runner retiring a human could bring on another prohibition. And the end of the Wallace Corporation. We want to help you. Wallace Security will make sure that the body is lost in transit, but LAPD will requisition your memory of the retirement. But since this is the only copy of the event, we can make a few changes. He did try to warn you. Hey! I found a witness! Come up here! There he is. Ubik. It's a nice tag. But it does give the police a way to find him. You're lucky we're not off-world. Down here, no one's gonna stick their neck out over just one little homicide. But if the cops can identify any of these people, they will start knocking on doors. I've updated your memo. What you change here will be edited permanently with no flaws for the police to find. Give it a try on that graffiti.
Personal data detected. Federal ID records were lost in the blackout, but I'll double check any possible witnesses against LAPD's criminal files. In the meantime, use your memo to edit anything the police might use to find a name or address. I guess it's a good thing you're a Blade Runner. Good luck. There were probably more witnesses to find them. Traceable vehicle record detected. Traceable vehicle record detected. Data alteration complete.
citizen identified. Scan contains personal data. Alternate data created. Personal data identified. Randomized data placed. Data replacement is complete. Come back to the murder scene. There's something you need to see. Running out of time. Come back to the alley where the murder took. There you are. Good news. No one here has a criminal record. But the police did ask to review this memory, and there's one detail we can't forget. There. No replicant ID. Good thing you have friends in the Wallace Corporation. I made a record for him in our replicant database. Give him his numbers. Citizen identified. With the body gone, no one can say he wasn't a replicant. <laughs> 